Hello, I'm Dr. Troy Brunke, and I want to welcome you to my website. I'm the founder of Brunke Chiropractic, as well as this website, MontereyBBT.com, and I've been a practicing chiropractor here in Monterey since 2000. Are you tired of running around from doctor to doctor taking various medications, effectively playing Russian roulette with various medications? Seems like they're coming up with a new drug every month only to have poor side effects and, and unfortunately not very many results. Are you constantly struggling with pain day in and day out? You're living in chronic pain and it's affecting your life and, and your relationships? Well, I'm here to tell you that there is hope. To see some of the testimonials of the patients who we've helped here in the office, please see the testimonials part in this website here at MontereyBBT.com. Now, what makes us different from other doctors you might have seen? Well, we treat you both metabolically and neurologically. You're on this website because either you or a loved one is suffering from chronic pain and you've probably been told that uh, there's no hope for you. Well, I'm here to tell you that in this office no stone is left unturned until we find out what the true cause of your problem is. And what I'm about to tell you, I guarantee you that no other doctor has told you. I'm going to address what makes my program unique and how I success, successfully treat chronic conditions. I do that by, by assessing the metabolic needs of the patient as well as the neurological needs of the patient. And let me explain. First of all, <clears throat> when you come to the office, we will uh, see if you're a candidate for our care. One of the things we do to treat you metabolically is to run a series of metabolic tests, blood panels, for example. And it's important to realize that there are many different kinds of tests that we perform in this office. Uh, some of you may require all of them, some of you might require a few of them, but the majority of what we need to do is find out what uh, is affecting you metabolically in your system first before we begin any treatment. For example, we do sensitivity testing to foods. It's very important. You might have a gluten sensitivity which is a protein found in wheat, corn, uh, excuse me, not corn, wheat, oats, uh, barley, for example. You might have a food sensitivity to soy or milk, yeast, things of this nature. If you have a sensitivity to any of these foods, it could be making your condition worse because it's causing a systemic inflammation in your body, adding to the fire, if you will, uh, with this constant onslaught of daily inflammation. So that needs to be checked out. Some of the symptoms that uh, might um, uh, let us know uh, that you have a possible food allergy is uh, bloating, belching after, after eating. You might have um, constipation or diarrhea. You might uh, vary between constipation and diarrhea. You could have mouth ulcers. Sometimes there's vomiting. Um, even brain fog or forgetfulness can uh, uh, indicate that you have a food sensitivity. In fact, there are children who are having learning disabilities because they're actually allergic to food. And the only way to find this out is if we run the tests. We also do complete blood panels, uh, excuse me, blood panels in this office. And uh, for example, that would include a thyroid panel, uh, a complete CBC, a lipid panel, uh, uh, the CBC with uh, auto differential. We can assess, uh, assess how your thyroid is working, how your kidneys are functioning, um, your gut function. All of these can be affected with chronic conditions. And by addressing any of these problems, we can really get to the root cause of what may be contributing to your chronic pain or your chronic condition. Uh, this also allows us to check, of course, your blood glucose levels to find out how you're handling blood sugar, and that's very important because it is sugar uh, or glucose, if you will, that uh, is an essential um, uh, fuel for the nervous system, the brain in particular. So, now I find that there are four problems um, when we're uh, that we have to rule out when we're dealing with someone with chronic pain, and that is anemia and what kind of anemia it is, blood sugar or um, sugar handling stress, and that goes hand in hand with adrenal stress, and we'll talk a little bit more about that. 
There's the gut function, uh, the gastrointestinal and liver function. We have to assess that, as well as fatty acid metabolism. Now let me talk briefly about the adrenal stresses and, and what that is. The adrenal glands are two uh, small glands that sit right on top of the kidneys. They're about the, about the size of an almond. And uh, when we're under stress, they will produce a hormone called cortisol. Uh, they also are responsible for producing adrenaline. Now, when you have chronic pain um, and you have sometimes uh, uh, you can't sleep and you have a, a tremendous amount of stress with this, both relationship stress, financial stress, work stress, it causes the body and the adrenal glands to produce cortisol. And um, this is something that we need to address to find out how much cortisol is in your system because cortisol is is a neurotoxin to the brain. If you're suffering from insomnia, we definitely need to check this. Some of the other things we need to check would be immune panels. Your chronic condition actually could be caused by an autoimmune condition. Um, this could be, this autoimmune condition could be attacking your brain and, and or you know, nervous system. So uh, we would definitely want to check that out. Some of the other things that uh, we do here in the office, as I mentioned, is that in addition to the metabolic testing, we do neurological treatments. And uh, I am a chiropractor, and uh, this is one of the things that we do here in the office. We will assess how your nervous system is functioning. And when we find that out, we'll be able to apply certain specific treatment protocols to bring your nervous system back into balance or to take the stress off of the nervous system and you feel better. Some of the things that we use here in the office are oxygen therapy. Oxygen is actually fuel for your brain and nervous system. Your brain and nervous system basically need two things to function properly. That is fuel and stimulation. Fuel is in the form of glucose, as we mentioned, and oxygen. Stimulation is in the form of the input that we're getting from the environment. Now there can be too much stimulation or too little stimulation and uh, we can address which one that is um, if you become a patient here. But what we do is for people with chronic pain is we'll put you on a program of exercise therapy when you're ready with oxygen. We have upper body extremity workouts, we have lower body extremity workouts for 15 to 20 minutes with uh, oxygen therapy and uh, it's saturating the, the body with uh, additional oxygen here in the office. We also use something called brain-based therapy and this is work pioneered by Dr. Frederick Carrick who is a chiropractic neurologist and uh, essentially it's finding out which side of the brain is not functioning properly and bringing both sides of the hemispheres of the brain into better communication. Some of the other things that we use in the office are vibration, um, laser therapy, and we have non-surgical spinal decompression that helps to take the pressure off of the discs and the nerves and you heal faster. Once we've run these necessary tests to determine your specific condition, we can then successfully treat you via these proper metabolic and neurological treatment protocols. So ask yourself the following questions. How has your chronic condition affected your life, your work, your finances, your relationships, and what has it cost you in the way of time and money, experiences for example? Where do you picture yourself in three to five years uh, if this isn't handled correctly? And finally, what is it worth to you to find out if, if uh, you can be helped? Finally, please share this information with a friend if you know of someone who could benefit from this information. Don't keep us a secret. Now you might be wondering if we um, can accept you as a treatment for care. Not all patients will be accepted. I wish I could accept everyone, but when you call I can make the final determination if we can accept you for care after our initial evaluation. So please, call our office at 372-5602, that's area code 831-372-5602, and uh, call us to set up your evaluation to find out if we can help you. It will change your life. And thanks for watching.